During your travels, of course, you're going to wind up in a church or a cathedral or a palace or a museum or somewhere where the lighting is low. And I know what you're going to think. I better put up a tripod or I better put up something like that. You're actually not going to need to because your phone camera uses its version of auto ISO. It'll automatically allow you to handhold in low light situations and still look really good. Now, if you have a very, very old iPhone, you're shooting on like an iPhone 5 or something, it's probably going to be pretty noisy. But if you have a reasonably last two or three years, you won't even notice the noise. It'll do a really, really good job. All you have to do is literally turn and shoot. Now, in a dark situation like this, of course, you do want to hold your camera as still as you can, right? You want the sharpest shots. You're still going to be thinking, I need to hold my camera still. But also, what you're going to do is consider using your ultra-wide. If your camera is one of the pro models and has the ultra-wide, the 0.5, this would be an obviously great place to use that. But really, all there is to do is turn and shoot it and do it. So let's go ahead and do it. I'm going to put it on 0.5 turn around and shoot. Here we go. Nice. If you love photography and you have an iPhone, then join us this March at the iPhone Photography Conference. Sign up at kelby1live.com.